quite an impressive show of support in Dearborn today for an organization that many of us don't really know that much about. The group is called Humble Designs and they help people who used to be homeless furnish their new homes. The need is massive. But as Nick Monticelli reports tonight, there is a new source of help, a warehouse filled with everything they need to start their lives over again. It really is amazing to see how fast this transformation is taking place. But what's also really cool is to understand what this used to be and what it's going to be. It was an empty warehouse. Now it's becoming essentially a warehouse of hope. You want two of them? It takes a lot for a man like Bassam El Kavaj to break out of his shell and get comfortable telling his story. But all the support makes it a little easier. Bassam fled from Iraq, enlisted in the U.S. Army, and then served overseas as an interpreter for nine years. But when he got home, he could not find a job and ended up sleeping in his car. I've been left behind, and that was very painful. That lasted three months until the VA helped find him a home, but he had absolutely nothing to put in it. How you doing? That's where Julie Nagel of Humble Designs comes in. This is their warehouse in Pontiac filled with donated goods. They work with the homeless population once they get a home and furnish it with all this for free. Because they're sleeping on the floor. They have nothing. And so what we do is we come in and give them a home. And this new space in Dearborn will do the same, but for veterans. So it's kind of like a department store of donated goods. U-Haul of Detroit recently bought this building and donated 11,000 square feet of it to Humble Designs. And AAA of Michigan provided the manpower for this transformation. Thank you for volunteering, man. Meaning more veterans like Bassett can transform their lives, too. It was not just a hope. It was as well like a, that light, you know, I was waiting for the light. It's like when you say, you know, end of the tunnel. That exactly that thing when they came in to my house. In Dearborn, Nick Monticelli, Local 4. Yeah, now this year, Humble Designs is going to help 52 veterans from the new location. Next year, they hope to help three families a week, meaning more than 150 families would be helped. Great program. They do so yeah. much, and when they go into these homes, they really Such a transformation, isn't it? Yeah.